This episode contains discussions that might be triggering for some listeners. I would say, like, there was uh, an exclusion that we experienced, uh, my siblings and I. And I, for me, it was double because I was this very effeminate uh, young child who, you know, like, the world tried to see me as a boy or kept telling me that I was one, but I did not see myself as one. And also, I believe that they didn't see me as one either. It was just... Uh, that is what was expected uh, because of my, you know, what lay between my legs, really. Um, and and so there was, in that experience of, of violence or domestic abuse, actually, and I've said this before, um, in some ways, my transness was hidden because we were all just mostly coping with uh, the good days and the bad days of, of the violence and and because outside was also so dangerous for me because you know like I I was not a trans woman who could or a trans child who could mask her gender identity like I really wore it and expressed myself as I was um, but I went to an all boys Catholic school and and so there was violence everywhere uh, from name calling to physical abuse um, and in slightly older life, uh, sexual violence, sexual abuse as well. Um, so despite the violence in my home, it was much safer than outside. Mm -hmm.